Now let's get to this developing story from Detroit's west side where the search is on for a group of armed carjackers. Pretty bold ones too. A scary scene here. Surveillance video captured it all. The very terrifying moments as two people walked out of a gas station towards their vehicle. And now police are hoping that sharing this video will help lead to the arrest of the people behind this scary carjacking at gunpoint. Here's Nick Monticelli. Good morning. This happened on the city's west side in the 1300 block of Plymouth, which is pretty close to Schaefer Highway. And we know these types of things happen, but it's rare to catch it on camera like this. And of course, we're told just to get in and get out and try to avoid these things. But that's exactly what these two people were doing. Three men in the silver Ford Taurus are waiting for the victims to leave the gas station. As soon as the man appears, the driver gets out of the car and points a gun at him. It scares me to death, you know? I'm up in to the store, I'm in the gas station, and then you can't leave, it's a lot of chaos. The victim puts his hands up, and that's when two other men get out of the Silver Taurus. At gunpoint, one thief starts searching the victim's pockets and pulls out the keys to the black Nissan. The other victim immediately puts her hands up. The third thief heads straight for the woman. He doesn't search her pockets, but takes food she had just bought right from her hands. I heard seeing somebody steal stuff out the store, but not just out of their hand. It's crazy. After both victims are robbed, the driver keeps waving the gun around while one of his partners gets in the Silver Taurus and the other gets in the Nissan. The male victim then walks back into the gas station. With her arm still raised, the female victim slowly backs away. The trio then takes off, stealing that 2018 black Nissan. Everybody needs to just be aware of their surroundings and just get in, get out, and be gone. It really is scary. It could happen to me. Now, of course, the reason the Detroit Police Department put this video out is they're hoping somebody recognizes these three men. If you do, if you know anything, if somebody talked, please call the Detroit Police Department. I'm Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News Today.